You, everybody, welcome to the stream. Um, Evan, that does sound pretty damn uh, ridiculous and crazy. Hello. Oh, hey, check out my shirt and tell me if the text is backwards or not because, um, I can reverse the camera so it doesn't look derpy. Is that not like the coolest shirt ever? <laughs> uh, and my hair is a disaster. Fantastic. Okay. Um, Cab, thank you for hosting. Appreciate it. I have to make things work. Mm -hmm. Message it to him, but he did your job today. He's probably passed out by now. Did he get like super duper drunk? Like really drunk? 
<laughs> Cab. Uh. <laughs> uh. Wait. Lincoln boobs. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> but seriously, was the text on my shirt backwards? Because I reversed the camera and it might be backwards now. <laughs> Hello, Rapsha. The apple of his butt. Well then. It was the right Ray Wong. Yes, 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 yes. Right. I did it right. <laughs> I have no headphones yet. Don't do, don't do the lag here. Dude, the servers, seriously. I almost couldn't, um, I almost could not get Twitch to come back on. I went and checked the status of like a bunch of the servers and stuff and there was like a shitload of them down. It was really bad. So I don't know if that like screwed up all of my stuff. <laughs> yeah, Evan, you are like fat fingering everything. I'm like, what the crap, dude? <laughs> so yeah, I have to make sure all of my stuff's actually um functioning. <laughs> Damn it, Evan, what the crap? Okay, that's working. Yay. Myrtle, you stalker. I know you're here. No, you're here. So here. All right, I gotta try to pull up the game here and see if it actually um works. <sighs> Let's see. Load. Um, we want this one. Load. All right, and I have to move that. Hello world, or move a rock. Well, this sounds fair. <laughs> Myrtle lurks in the dark. <gasps> oh no! Myrtle. All right, I have to make sure this is showing up all right for you guys. And it appears so. Move it over just a hair. There you go. Okay, I think you guys can see it all right. The world named Fred. <laughs> oh, okay. Hey, guy. Hey, oh, hi, Booming. <laughs> hi, yeah. <laughs> you guys. This is goobers. All right. That's good. Frames are good. All right. I think everything is working. Oh, shit. I had to get my headphones. What the frick? Do I want the derpy ones or do I want the big no she has the big ones? Picture of the turtle I sent to every chat I could find. What? Interesting. Why is this knotted? I am a freaking rat, guys. I'm sorry. I've had a really, really long day of cooking and baking and standing, and I hurt. Huh. So, anyway, happy St. Patrick's Day, everybody. Is anybody getting drunk? Oh, shit, that's too loud. I'm getting deafened. Okay, so let's try to do something. I'm not sure what we were doing. Um, where's my log? All right, let's see. Triangle tribe guard won't let Cap on the island. It looks like they're racist against whatever it is that she is. She's going to wait in the basement while I find Meredith. I'm supposed to go down and visit her when I'm ready to learn some magic. Duh. It looks like a penis. Evan, I'm sorry. Drank some whiskey, but not too much. That should have crashed more. Did he get like super duper, like, like really, really wasted? I mean, really? 
like belligerent crazy. This is the last drink that I have in the house, so I am just going to kind of sip at this and enjoy it. Oh my god, Myrtle. What did you just do? I don't even know if the thing is working. <laughs> yeah, you're all drunk, Sam. I saw that. Damn it. Myrtle's thing popped up, but it didn't pop up in the other thing. Give me a sec. See, I knew with Twitch having problems, that wasn't going to work. Yes, restart. Okay. Whoa, shit. I hate that it goes right back into that. Like, really? Alright, what did Myrtle say? Myrtle, guess what? Chicken butt. <laughs> Also, here's some funds to the donation goal. It's already past 20 bucks. Woo! <laughs> ah, thank you, Myrtle. <laughs> you goofball. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Anyway. Oh, I just noted that it says top D. Yeah, I changed it to top D. <laughs> Oh, I checked that in the game froze. You whore face. <sighs> there we go. Oh, you son of a bitch. All right, there. Ah. <laughs> Damn it. I got the top D sounds about right. <laughs> Thank you, Myrtle. <laughs> Ugh, I gotta clear the... Uh, notification on my phone so it'll stop blinking in my face. Anyway. Let's see what he wants. Or she. God damn it, I keep forgetting this is a girl. Aw, I'm sorry. Evan? I... I got nothing. I don't know. Alright, I want to tell you how and why it works, and you'll have to learn it all eventually, but I can skip the explanation for now, if you're really, excuse me, really in a hurry. Stop that right now. <laughs> I have time, I want to understand. Stroke again? Hello. Myrtle, where are you on that one? I have to go AFK. Oh, that's fine, Cap. Totally fine. I appreciate that you actually popped in and are hosting me. Okay, <sighs> let's start with the big questions. The first big question of magic, how is magic possible? <laughs> a lot of people just think that there must be a lot of universes where all kinds of things are possible and that Fred is just one that happens to have magic. But that's wrong. Maybe there are lots of universes, maybe even one without shrimp. Uh, I'm not sure why shrimp is important. Be here and there in the stream, Myrtle, that's okay. I mean, I know you guys have, like, stuff that you're probably doing or want to do or whatever. It's totally fine. <laughs> My thing gets mute. <laughs> I snorted. <laughs> Evan, oh, slow down to type. Anyway, all right, one without shrimp. <laughs> Dutch word for sending is version. Twitch merges those when I send a message. It makes it <laughs> really. You had to add ice it. <laughs> Booming. That's funny. And Myrtle, come on. <laughs> That's just like having lots of copies of the same lame board game. The pieces might be in different places, but the rules would always be the same. In some ways, Fred is like a universe, and the fact that you're here proves it can exchange information with him. 
but it can't be one because its rules change all the time. More importantly, sometimes they change based on what we want from it. I will never slow down. <laughs> Freddy's actually aware of us, at least on some level. That's where the magic comes from. The second big question of magic, why does Fred follow it? Wait, why does Fred allow it? <gasps> you know what, Merle. <laughs> and I can't read because I'm trying to read too fast. This one is a little controversial. There are places where they teach that Fred loves us and that magic is a gift to anyone special enough to understand it. But that's hard for me to believe. When you do it, there isn't the sense that you're being given something. It's more like you're pushing on Fred and it's breaking. Or at least getting out of your way. Oh, interesting. <laughs> the books I was given the ones published in Everglow take the position that Fred has no choice but to allow magic, that it is weak or defective in some way. And that when you do magic, you take advantage of that weakness to force something from your mind into Fred. Back in a bit, gonna move to bed. Ah, yes, lay down, relax, be comfortable. And we'll see in a bit. Alright, um... Alright, I force something from your mind into Fred. Come on. You guys. I mean, really. <laughs> uh, which is why doing it well requires the sort of intensity of vision. Something more than focus and will. The third big question of magic. What about magic words and silly rituals? I would like to do some silly rituals. Mary had a... Little lamb whose fleece was white as snow. And everywhere that Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. Some old magic is like that to Fred. Once it hears the name or the first few notes, it can't help itself filling in the rest. And, like with training animals, the trigger can be totally arbitrary. Magic words, rituals, whatever, they're just things Fred has been taught to associate with certain pieces of magic over time. Ah. But those days, your interface... These days... Your interface does most of that automatically with common interface protocol symbols. What? When you try to do magic, your interface will filter your intent and then try and match it to a known spell or a combination of spells. Oh, Jesus. If it finds a match, it will just send Fred the standard SIP symbol or symbols, and Fred will know exactly what you're asking it for. Okay, that's just this is weird. You still have to supply the will, but because the message is so clear, it's much easier to get Fred to do what you want. Yeah. Of course, if you're trying to write new magic or stretch a spell beyond its normal scale, then things become a lot more complicated. <laughs> that's, a, that's a good quote. Understand? No, I don't understand. This is just fucking bizarre. I don't know what is happening. Good for now. <laughs> I'm going to start off with a basic piece of physical magic. I call it move a box <clears throat> oh by the way guys the commands the the hugs and honks you can also say you know like i hug and something the person's name so you can do like a couple things so you can be like you know i can honk and fondle or grope or you know whatever so have fun it okay um Ah! What the? Visualize specifically what you want, believe the lie, and then find the muscle that allows you to push it out of your head and into the world. Uh, you just have to get it started. Once your interface recognizes what you're doing, it will pull your thoughts in the direction it thinks you want them to go. Oh, jeez. And if you feel like giving you options, just go with the defaults honks and maybe squeezes my butt. Man, my ass is popular. Freaking crap. Yeah, oh, okay. Uh, how do I do the map? I couldn't move it. It's okay. There's a training wheels version that your interface should have an easier time recognizing. Pick four points in the air in front of the box. 
color them in make them solid. Then harden the air between them and slam the whole thing into the box. Do what? I started my mind was on rails and I knew it was going to work but now I feel sort of cold <coughs> Evan it is popular every night every day every time Matt is anywhere near me because he will be the first one to say that he is amazingly fond of Matoshi yeah <coughs> That's because your interface defaults using body heat as a source. Okay, so I'm using my body heat to do magic, which in turn is making me cold. Oh, yay. That's really all you did. Convert heat into light and momentum. Don't worry, your interface will cut you off before you give yourself hypothermia. Fantastic. Fantastic. Did my bot just take a poop? <laughs> Try the quote again. No, just just do the just, yeah. Oh god damn it. Did it seriously honk out? It's like totally ah cab, hi you're back. Best thing about living with your other half is touching the butt when they walk past. Dude, I get groped constantly. Oh my god. Why is my god this too much work? <laughs> Alright, give me a few sacks. Sex. Wow, Freudian slip there. Wee. Um I'm gonna look at the bot here. Oh. Um, okay. Try again, Evan. I know it's not super useful, but if you do that to a person instead of a box, you'll knock them back and maybe stun them a little. I'm going to go back up into the sun, but I'll stay close to the boat. Good luck. Whoa, I have a magic thing now? You can cast your new spell by pressing three. Oh. Using magic consumes focus just like blocking. Ow, oh, fuck. Nice! But damn it, now you probably broke it again. <laughs> try, try the quote thing and see if it's broken. I swear to god, if it's broken, I'm gonna cry. Oh, okay, it's working. That's good. I need to put my hair up. Sorry. I'm getting warm sitting here. <sighs> I didn't know she was dead already. <laughs> okay, there. <sighs> Much better. Alright. Now, what the hell am I doing? Am I supposed to go back out now? That thing scares me. Look at Molly. Like, look at it. It's evil. Evil. I'm taking a screenshot of evil Molly. Alright, I think I'm supposed to leave. I think. Ah. Uh. Progress. <laughs> Wonderful. Wow. Alright, give me another sec. 
I said sack that time. Damn it. Dog is evil. That's not what I want. That's what I want. It is launched, but it's not working. I'm really sad because I had like went to all this trouble to like make something and it was like super cool and now it's not working and that makes me really sad. Okay, well, what's over here? Nothing. There's another dude. I don't need to really go to the star blocks because I don't need any help. Let's run. What the frick is this? Oh. My. God. What am I seeing? <laughs> Evan. Booming returns. But Dressing rooms. It, it's an elevator. Um, where did I just go? Help! This is sort of creepy. Cre what is this? This gave me a raise. Oh my god. It what the um this hap yeah. Is that boobs? Is that square boobs? What is going on down here? What is, I need to talk to you. What is happening in here? No 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 let me in, let me in. I wanna go in, I wanna go in, no 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 uh, I want to come in here. You're naked. What is what is this room? And what is he holding? Oh my god, this is like freaking bizarre. What's in the next room? Holy shit. It, whoa. Oh, they are doing naughty things down here. Oh man. Oh my god. Oh, I can't get in that one. Damn it. What the frick? <laughs> Dude, seriously, she had square boobs. Like, her boobs were literally out. I was not expecting that. I mean, we're in a f***ing store. Like, what? Oh, there's all the dressing rooms. And then the random door over there that took me down into their, like, you know, love dungeon or something? Like, what is happening? What are you people doing down there? Welcome to random noise. What can I help you with? for a hippie girl. She's got a bit of rainbow floating around her head. Well, I don't think we have any hippies, but you're welcome to check the modelarium downstairs. I did. 
And what the hell, lady? What the hell? Alright, well, we're just gonna... Wow. Oh my god, what is the Bob doing? Uh, honks? You're gonna honk somebody's butt. They're eight. Yeah, bot's goofing big time. Let me check it. it edit twice. That's okay. Totally fine. Yeah, just make sure it's exclamation mark and then either honk or hug and then you have an S. Like hugs or honk. And then you can say, you know, like I honk and squeeze or hug and squeeze or I mean you can add other things to it if you are feeling feisty. Okay. Like this. This coming from the guy who's fat fingering everything. And why did I just walk into the stairs? Uh... Apparently, I can't climb stairs, so I'm not doing that again. <laughs> he honked your butt, didn't he? Oh, it's another one of these weird dudes. It's over there. Whoa. I'm trying to find someone. Can I go in and look around? Sorry, but we had an incident last night and had to put the camp on lockdown. You're welcome to come back later. Fuck you, man. I don't want to come back later. I'm going to beat your face now. Let me in. Can I climb the ladder anyway? Oh, it won't let me in. Oh, you're so mean. Because you're mean. I don't even like you. This game is freaking weird. It is so, so weird. I guess we should probably talk to this dude over here. Welcome to our community brewery. Sorry we don't give tours. What the fuck? Actually, I'm looking for a hippie girl. Have you seen any? Those are some seriously cool shoes. Did you, like, steal them from an actual old person? So that's that out. What? Oh, yeah, hippie girls. We have a couple back there doing community service. They tried to liberate a few of our gnomes last night while everyone was distracted with the semi-weekly bacchanalia. So they have gnomes, lots of drugs in this game, rabid squirrels, giant hermit crabs, vampires, endless tunnels, trolls. Wow. <laughs> ah, so they were each sense to donate half a liter of tears. Yeah, this is a brewery, Evan. Keep up! Yeah, they have dead eyes that stare into your soul. Mm hmm. They're refined and then mixed into the beer. Makes the buzz heavier, more significant. <laughs> no, Rapture Ears was rather. You know, but there was weed in the game. We saw it. They had lots of drugs. And dirty hippies. Right, so can I check to see if one of them is a girl I'm looking for? I can tell from your shoes you've been places, and I respect that. I'd let you in if I could. But I don't have a key to this thing. And what fucking good are you? You and your weird pants. I just watch things and blow my whistle if I see something scary like a bear. Wow. 
So maybe if you could find me some shoes like yours, I might remember where you could find someone with a key. Now I'm on a goddamn freaking hunting pond here. I'm not giving my shoes. No. If I took them, it'd be a different collection of stuff. It would be like a person died, like I killed you. You'll have to find another pair of old people's shoes. Ugh. Yeah, it says watch person. What's with the moving fund? Well, all the donations that I get from now until, like, the end of, I don't know, we'll say May, are gonna solely be used for us to move. I was using it just as a, uh, a means to get more games or, um, you know, to put it towards, you know, any bills or whatever, but we're really serious about wanting to move and it has to be by the end of May because that's when our lease here is up. So I thought, you know what, why not just say, this is what you're giving me money for if you do. It's not just for me to just blow on something stupid. It actually is for a purpose and that is for us to move. So even if I only made a few bucks, hey, that's a few bucks I didn't have before. So that's the long-winded explanation of the moving fund. <laughs> I talk too much. Plot twist. He named his dick Whistle. Boom. Head explodes. Maybe we just all around because you need to be high to understand stuff. Maybe. Maybe. But apparently I have to find this dipstick some motherfucking shoes that look like mine, which coincidentally look just like his. Ugh. Some water? Ooh. Okay. So do I gotta like go back in that store and see if they have shoes in there? I feel so dirty going into the store just because of what I saw downstairs. I don't think there is shoes in here though. That's the thing. I didn't see any. It's all just like shirts and I think those are shirts or pants. I don't know. Hey lady. Oh, you won't talk to me anymore. I have scrunchies. Oh, that does me no good. I solved most of my homework. I was on LST actually. Damn! If that is true, that is amazingly impressive. Logic. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm going to run up this ginormous hill and see what happens. Is this seriously the only thing on the top of this hill? Fuck you people! Fuck you and your stupid community! <sighs> you use bear booming. That brings you. God, why do they play this in the Starbucks? Welcome back. Wait, where are you in the other one? I'm actually in all of the Starbucks in this region. Wait, what? They multiplex you when you take the job. It improves consistency between branches. That's kind of scary. Well, I was an English major in college back on Old Earth. It wasn't like I had many options, but it's really a pretty good job. They take great care of you, and I get to be in a hundred cafes at once, soaking all this craziness in. Good God! <laughs> Myrtle, Jesus. You're from Earth? How did you get here? On Earth, I worked in the Starblocks on 17th and Broadway on the corner of Union Square. What? One night after closing, I came out of the bathroom to find that while I was still in a Starblocks, it wasn't the right Starblocks. I could see daylight outside. All four baristas were the same person, and of course it was full of monsters. I unfainted. 
He explained that I was in a magical world called Fred and offered me a job. Apparently, it happens more often than you'd think, considering how rare paths are. Similarly, supposedly attracts them, like they get off on connecting two places that are already almost the same. Uh, okay, well, I'm totally done talking to you right now. Whoa. Christmas music and not Christmas season seems legit. Yeah, totally, after everything else so fucking bizarre. Hey, who are you people? Can I talk to you? Oh, it's What's-His-Face and, um, the, the Voldemort and his vampire girlfriend. What are you guys doing in here? Why won't you talk to me? am I supposed to do? Nobody is telling me anything. And that guy wants to choose. Because I can just make shoes magically. What is this? Forget getting high yourself. This game of weirdness does that for you. Yeah, because it's completely blowing my noggin. What the ever-loving frick. I'm taking screenshots of this stuff because nobody's gonna believe that this really is a game. I can't jump off. That sucks. I'd probably you know, break my legs severely and be dead, but you know, whatever. She's on that next level, so... Look at her eyes! Mm. It won't let me fall off. It literally will not let me fall off. Well, what the fuck am I supposed to do? I asked around, and nobody's freaking seen this hippie dipstick. <sighs> okay, a couple of hippies. She doesn't have a cave and tell me... Where I can get one if I can bring him some old man shoes. <sighs> well, there's an old guy walking around out here. Maybe I can just jump him and take his shoes. I mean, I don't really want to jump an old guy, but you know, hey, desperate times call for desperate measures. Quiet. I'm looking for sprinkles. Sorry to interrupt, but I was wondering if I could borrow your shoes. It's for a good cause. Another shoe thief? Like, what? what do you mean another shoe thief? Run away! <laughs> Give me your shoes! Oh my god! I seriously just bopped him over the head and stole his shoes! Oh my god! I think I just killed an old man! Oh my god! Dude, I think I killed him. I just killed an old guy! Oh, run away! Run away! Nobody saw anything. It's fine. Oh god. You didn't see nothing either. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I think I did. Oh god. Oh, here I got your shoes. Sorry, but I did some super saturated thinking while you were looking for old people to kill for their shoes. <laughs> the stuff that makes shoes better than foot scabs. It's all socially constructed. What the fuck is he? So, like, if I trade my knowledge for shoes, then we all stop believing shoes are worth having. I'll be left with nothing. What? You have to be fucking kidding me. How about I promise that I'll never stop believing in shoes? Fuck Jesus! <laughs> yes, I just used my hard yellow stick on an old man. <laughs> I guess that would work, as long as you're still alive at least. 
so you have to promise to eat right and exercise and to stay away from the dangerous kinds of animals like bears. That's how I imagine this guy talks. I promise. Now tell me where to find someone with a key. One of the brewmasters, Hugo, is running a full day scenario in the house of free love. Considering he's distracted and separated from his clothes, oh, we might even be able to steal his key without beating him up first. Um, and where is the house of free love, may I ask? Is it down in the basement of this place? No, that's the model something or other. Is it one of these places? Like, where the... Because last time I tried to walk up the steps and I walked in the steps. Ooh, yeah. Okay, um... Or is he over in the hippie thing, maybe? House of Free Love. Where is that? Because I like, I don't have a map of this effing place. Ugh. Great. Where do I go? Would it maybe be over on the hippie side because he's all free love and whatever? Probably. Where is this place? Is it the place up on the hill maybe? Fuck, I have no idea where this is. I guess I can try going up there. Please. Free love. Oh, please let this be it up here. Let me steal your keys. And maybe your clothes so that you have to run around naked for a while. Just because I mean. How's the free love? There must be some cheap flickers there. Real time for a bunch of dirty hippies, probably. Mm -hmm. oh. A house of free love. Free as in freedom, not as in beer. Mm -hmm. Seriously, that's what that says. Screenshot. I tried to walk up the steps. I walked into the steps. It's bizarre. Please let this be it. Hey, oh, hello. Uh, um, can I... There we go. Welcome to the House of Free Love, where everything is available for a price. How can I help you today? Hi, I'm looking. Wait, anything? I need to borrow something from one of your guests. It's for a good cause. Sure, we do that. Who and what? Hugo, I need his key to the brewery. Well, he's doing a one last time before we freeze to death thing up there. Whoa. This is getting freaky. Definitely in costume. Oh my god, these black people are freaky! He'll have left his stuff in the wardrobe. You can dig through it for a hundred bits. I don't have any money. Isn't there some random thing I could do for you instead? Well, there have been some shortages since we lost access to the Lincoln Everglow. 
And it's not like we can manufacture plastics ourselves. What? Condoms. We need more. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, God. This game is amazing. I'm just going to just call it right now. This game's amazing. And we know that the Triangle Tribe's gnomes are growing them. If, wait, growing them? If you bring me their current crop, I'll take them in trade. <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? Oh my god, like, what is this? Oh, what the hell? Okay. Okay. Steal condoms from the Triangle Tribe. Somehow their gnomes grow them. So now I'm headed back to the Triangle Tribe's island to look for a field of rubbers. <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> That's because, Evan, it's a sex den. What else am I going to be thinking, you know? And yes, I think Matt should try to play this too because he would do the same thing as me. Just, what the fuck is this? <sighs> Triangle Tribe. I have to find the gnomes. Who are growing... Rubbers on an island. What the? Oh my god. What did I? I have no words right now. I can't even. <laughs> oh my god. I just, I literally can't even. Like what, what is, oh my god. Okay, so that is where I came from on the boat, I think. So, do you think it's those, like, pod people that we saw over yonder? Do you think that's what she's talking about? Like, I literally don't know. Oh, crap, I'm gonna go around. I, I uh, what? What the hell? <laughs> yeah, I have to do that thing. That's, that's, the, hey, wait, where'd the old guy go? Um, I'm really hoping the old guy disappeared because he got up and walked away. And not, um, he's really dead dead and, you know. Okay, so can I just like knock these things down or something? Because I know these are people, but this is like the only islandy thing. Nope. This is like the only islandy thing right here. They buried him. <laughs> and down here is the weird, you know, pot growing guy. I don't think there's a field of rubbers down there. Oh god, I hate having to search for stuff and not, you know, knowing exactly where I'm going. Ugh. Alright, let's go back into the drug factory. Hey, where's Druggy? Dirty hippie's gone. I take your stuff. Damn it. Look at all the pretty drugs. Yay! Dog. Oh. It's 
more pot plants. This is all just drugs. This is not rubbers. <laughs> Apparently, my bot has I'm in its own. I hope it doesn't mean I have to travel back on, like, the boat. Because I don't want to go back on the boat. And the gnomes, as far as I know, the gnomes are like all over here. Oh, this is just ridiculous and confusing. I just... Arg. <laughs> Your internet just failed for no reason. Damn. That sucks, dude. I'm, I'm sorry. Okay. Okay, it's over here. Wait, what? Awesome, squeeze is a day. Just totally did that. High five, dude. High five. Way to go. It's over there, and that douche hammer won't let me in. Okay, so I'm all here about worked for the honk, but won't work for a quote. Hold on. It's being a bitch tits again. My apologies. It might work now. Oh, it's open. Oh, look at all the little gnome houses. Oh, it's a shame I'm not a giant. So I could just, you know, stomp them all. I know, that's really mean. I wonder if Smurfs live in there, too. Alright, but anyway. What? The ones who sorry will be the internet providers. I'll whack them with a giant dildo. Yes! Whack them with a giant dildo. These are glasses on trees. Um... I'm screenshotting that because no one would believe me. Jesus. Okay. Oh. My. God. Oh. My God. This is literally, okay. This is literally a thing. I'm seriously picking condoms right now. Oh my god. Oh my god, why is this a thing? Why is this happening? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What is that? Cement blocks. Jesus. I literally cannot believe I am doing this. this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is that all of them? Yeah, these all look like blocks. Oh my god. What else is in this crazy fucking play? Oh, let's go then. Uh oh. Don't star none. Won't be none. Need more green cupcakes? Well, there's plenty of green cupcakes at home. You know that. Hey, man. What's up? I am Titty Winkle. Oh my god, you can't even make this up. Like this, just, oh my god. And this is my garden. Return what you have stolen. 
And I shall let you pass. Oh god, I'm gonna get jacked by a freaking gnome. Do you know any of these condoms help a little blue girl stop the world from going to war? It does not matter what I believe you have stolen from my garden. So, look, man, I can't just like teleport the green cupcakes to you. You have to come home to eat them. Stop yelling at me. Say hello to Matt, everybody. <laughs> Catch me, you short little bastards. Wait, who am I giving the condoms to again? Free loved lady. That's right. Run, 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 run. Oh, hope they don't catch me. <laughs> My name is Titty Winkle. I did wreck that gnome. I totally did. <laughs> he pulled out his little tiny yellow bat and I was like, Pshing! Here's mine! <laughs> Done. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm being like majorly jumped and they just shoved me off. And I'm gonna die. And I'm gonna die. Wait, am I like, what is happening? Am I dying or not? Like, what is this? Um, wh whoa. Fail. Apparently, I was being chased. I didn't know it. The whole colony was chasing me. Oh my god, I think I have to do that all again. Oh no, we're right here. Okay. Oh, when gnomes strike. Yes, when gnomes attack. Hey man, what's up? Yeah, we've already been through this. Blah blah blah. Holy shit, I cannot believe they're fucking going to attack my face. Alright, I'm gonna have to just like turn around or something. And then, like. Wait, where are they? I thought they were chasing me. Oh shit, there you are. Oh, oh, where, where, where are you? Oh, you little mother. Oh, that little square trick I have is really cool. They're like popping up out of the woodwork, dude. Okay, are you guys like done freaking trying to attack my face? Popping in to say hi, I got stuff to load, see you in the green cupcakes when I get home. Well, alrighty then. Where are you? Come on, you little son of bitches. I'm climbing up the slider and getting jacked again. Pull their sticks and give you some major banging. Oh my god. <laughs> Go up the ladder quickly.
We're just gonna over a that. Cuz wolf. Alright, stupid lady, I write your stupid condoms. Okay, go right up there in room two. Oh god. <laughs> Tire species. <laughs> now I'm sure there's plenty more of them hiding in there. They just saw me and you know my big yellow bat and they were just like we're gonna stay here. You guys can deal with that. I'm sure they're fine. Right? Like the old guy. They're fine. I'm just gonna keep telling myself that. Oh god. Oh no. I'm gonna see something freaky. It will. Alright, room two. What the. Hello? Um. Yes. I don't want to see anything. I don't want to know anything. I just want to get out of here. Oh, no, they're not going to be attacking me, are they? Hey. I need to get to the star blocks and get some health back. Gnomes! They attack me. Jerks. No! <sighs> Probably gonna like as soon as they see me, just like try to attack my face. I'm a wanted man now. For no, I don't want him, and I don't want to see whatever was going on up there, and that he was in a costume. Ugh. I just need to guide the door to just let me get through, not harass me, so that. Can go do what I gotta do. Don't talk to me. Don't bother me. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh my God! Running up hills. Sucks. I need some free coffee. Oh, thank you. Restored. All right, now I need to go to this guy. I think. Hey, so yeah. Bioshock? I've actually never really played Bioshock. I mean, I've watched people play Bioshock and it was like awesome. But I haven't actually played it myself. I fully enjoy the game. I think the game's awesome. You know, I really wish I knew where I was going and who I was looking for and oh Jesus. people trying to attack me. I didn't do anything. Nope. Oh, there's a dude up there. 
Hey man, what's up? I'm down here and you can't get me. Wait, what? Oh god. Nice shoes. I guess. This is like insane. Oh my god, I can climb upstairs! <laughs> hey man, come back here. So I'm gonna smack you in the face with my bat. Did I get them? Did I get both keys? How do I know? Items. Brewery key, yeah. Magic coffee beans. Magical healing coffee bean. Eat it to heal 20 points. Oh, nice. I get a sack of cheesy poops. <laughs> you killed a kid. Hey man, they got in the way. <laughs> Trespass. Homicidal maniac. Hey. What can I say? Oh my god. This is just completely ridiculous. I want to use these other things, but I'm not supposed to. The coffee bean there because oh well, there's only two things I can all right <sighs> can I go through here no I had to come all this way to get this key from this douche hammer just so I can open up another gate and just whatever wait the stairs are over here god bless it oh god I think I just flew down the stairs. <laughs> Gate's out here, right? Wait, what did you just do? <laughs> Come back here. Yeah. Bed is too comfy. That's okay. I thank you for coming in though, Booming, and I hope that you have had fun and enjoyed this. Because this is ridiculous. <laughs> And uh, get some rest, and I will catch you again. Hugs, hugs. Thank you. <laughs>Rapture, are you going to sleep too? Am I losing everyone? Is everyone leaving me? I had a sad face. Oh god, I'm gonna get attacked again, aren't I? to say goodnight to boom you're not leaving <laughs> uh, oh that's sweet you just got me on your mind but you know alright I only see one person you won't leave aw thank you Evan come here bitch
Ah, I have no energy left. I hope nobody else attacks me. Anybody? Uh, can I loot you for anything? Nope. Can I step on you? Yes, I can. Tap dancing on your face. <laughs> Yep, I just tap dance on his chest. Anyway, <clears throat> your brain thought the stream was ending? No, no, not yet. Not yet. Gotta stop the weed for today. Maybe a little. Oh god. Bam! Can't let you guys, can I? Oh, did I just kick you? Ah. Ah. Wait, oh. Okay. I don't see anybody else. I'm sure they're hiding. You just appeared out of nowhere. Bitch. Ah! And there's a guy up there again. Oh, go. Oh, okay. Alright, God bless it. Bitch, did Yeah, I was tap dancing on his face and his chest. Totally just do 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 do. It was fun. Magical, even. Wait, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Hello! I need to smack you in the face and steal your key. Mirror. Oh, what is wrong with your face? Why are you trying to look like an American Indian, you fool? Crap, I have no more block left. And no more energy either. Biatch. Brewery key and more magic coffee beans. Oh my god, fuck it! <laughs> yes, you miss me. Um, you miss me tap dancing on a corpse. It was magical. It's fantastic. Alright, goodbye, sisters. Oh yes, you miss the condoms growing on trees. Amazing. That was really a thing. Like not even joking. Sunglasses, also, and um. Cement black. I'll have to make highlights of like just those snippets when I discover these things because What was the name of the game again? The World Named Fred. Yeah, I think we all need some of this. Yeah, the gnomes were banging me with their little yellow sticks while I pulled out my big giant yellow stick and beat them in the face with it. Again. Cells. What is this about? What are they doing in here? What the frick? Man, what? 
Oh, we already went to the sex dungeon. I saw square boobies. Ah! Nice, I totally blocked. Why can I not loot your face? What was the point of coming up here if I can't get through? No, well, that didn't work. No, that doesn't knock it open. What the fuck? She doesn't have a key or anything. Yeah, literal square cubes. Like, no joke. Cubies. Yes! Cubies! Totally cubies. There's a lever in there. I did a thing with my force. Ooh. What is with all these weird ass? Oh my God. Hello. What are twisted people doing? Dude, he's standing on his head. Opening the doors within the prison. Yeah! Um. <laughs> oh my god. Wah, wah. Oh man. I swear to God. Alright, there. Maybe it'll work now. Stop being so tarted. What the hell are they doing? I mean, clearly this is some sort of camera. And it... Um... Yeah, <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I had to, something is wrong with uh, my bot. When new quotes are added, it like, um, stops working. I have to actually like hit it and, ooh, more coffee beans, thank you. Is this all the tears that are being harvested? Oh, what the hell is going on? Yeah, totally, like making porn or something. Yeah. Tro was pretty drunk by the end of his stream. Oh, God. God, was everyone having a drunk stream tonight? You know, everybody but me. I can has doors now. Yay! Open all of the things. All of them. Open them all. I wanna open all the doors. We played Mount Your Friends. He started commentating. Oh god. Spit out words of gold. And I have to quote all the things. Aww. How sweet. You know, I wonder if I- Ah! I don't even have my dong out to beat him with. Fucker. Stupid. Probably should have checked everything downstairs before I come up here. Uh, 
Alright, I went through Da, but I didn't go down Cha. He bitch slapped me, that's what he did. Oh, what? Oh my god. They literally are dungeons. Oh my god, are you her? I'm looking for Meredith. She's not here. What? They showed us a sad movie to make us cry, but she's just kept giggling? No, yeah, she's twisted. So they took her up to the storeroom they used for solitary confinement? Once you're upstairs, you go through the metal door. That is the second room on your left. Thanks, do you need rescuing? No, I'm okay. I want to see the end of the movie and they'll probably let me out before dinner anyway. Uh, um... Well, I don't have the option to let you out anyway. Wow. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I said it. I think Matt would have said it too. Oh no, that's not what I want. I get lost so easy. I am worse than Matt. So many doors. I know it said a specific door, but I'm you know, just checking. See if there's anything else I can open. Um, open, not hit, stupid. <laughs> oh shit! Fuck, 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 fuck. Like how on the Steam page for the game it says highly polished minimalist interface. Is that actually what it says for it? Because I don't remember reading everything about it. I just read it just roughly what it was about and I was like, yeah, I, I want this game. It looks completely bonkers. <sighs> I'm Nate Nim. I'm here to rescue you. You're who? Yeah, I know it's a stupid name. Sorry, it's just that you're not one of my normal rescuers? Wait, you need rescued often? Lady, what the fuck? Normal rescuers? I'm heir to the first drum of salt tree. Basically a princess. I can't get locked in the bathroom without some dude with a sniffle bat turning up to rescue me. Okay. Right, I guess that's how it would work here, but I'm not only here to rescue you, I also need your help with some kind of shaman thing in Everglow. That's new. Oh, hi, uh, Skull, I didn't even see you. Hello, welcome. But sure, it looks like I'm done here anyway. Okay. Slapsticky. <laughs> Slapsticky. I like how her headband like is rotating colors. <laughs> All right, where am I supposed to take this hippie dipstick here? Hopefully, I'll find Meredith inside. I need to. Where do I need to take her? I think I need to. I don't know if I need to take her back to Cloud Dancer. Or just go find the little dude. Ven, hi, welcome. I'm okay. Um, I'm quite 
that sore from all of the standing and cooking and stuff that I did today, but otherwise I'm all right. How are you doing? And for that matter, how's everybody else? So I know some of you I haven't, um, I have not asked in a bit that, uh, have come. Eh. Oh, God. I swear I'm like 14. Say the word come and I giggle. <sighs> Wait, are you following me? Um, hey, lady. Rescuing you. Where are you? Hello. Tired, but okay. Yeah, I'm I'm tired, and like I said, it's kind of achy and sore. And where the fuck is she? Um, she literally has just. There you are. Oh, I should smack you. St. Patty's Day cookie. Um. Well, yeah, but I had some um cube steaks in the in the fridge that had thawed finally and I was like I really need to make these and I asked um, my Matt if he wanted to do the traditional you know like corned beef and cabbage kind of thing and he's like mm, I actually don't want to this year so she totally was trolling me like what the fuck bitch I just came to save you Ugh. follow me follow me But you better keep following me. I swear to God, when I find her, I will hit her with my giant yellow bat. A.K.A. Phallic device looking thing. A.K.A. Big yellow donor. Hey, side note. Speaking of big yellow things. Back when I was in high school and I was in marching band. Yeah, go figure, right? Me? Yeah. Giant band geek right here. Okay. Um... I don't know if you guys are familiar with marching band uniforms, but um, ours, our school colors were uh, blue and gold. Okay, so uh, we um, had very nice uniforms, just really nice uh, darker blue and everything, you know. And um, so the gold came in with like gold braid, whatever. But on our hats. We had those big feather things that, um, you know, kind of look like that bat. And they were just literally feathers. And um, we in the band um, lovingly um, dubbed them Big Bird Dicks. And we would go around putting our heads down so people could, you know, fondle them and stuff. And we'd be like, oh, yeah. What can I say? We had to amuse ourselves some way and to us that was very funny so backstory into my life you're welcome <laughs> and yes Evan the temperature dropped drastically uh, which way is it fuck me I think it's this way <laughs> yeah Foxy, that's literally what we called them. We called them Big Bird Dicks because they were bright yellow feathers, and I'm not even joking about it. I'm completely and utterly serious. It was a thing. Am I going to attack now that I have her? I hope not. Fondling the feathers. Dude, we totally did. It was the funniest thing and then and then eventually I can't remember after after I graduated they either got rid of them or they changed them to something else I can't remember so then there was no more big bird dicks and all of us that used to have them were kind of sad also another side note speaking of band um, my high school decided to get new uniforms a few years back, so they were recycling the old ones, ones that I wore. 
and they were recycling them and making the uniforms into throw pillows. Like, oh, this big. Really big and fluffy. And it was the uniform. I bought two of them. Because I had to. And I think one of them I actually might have worn because the number on it looked really familiar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's my life. Giant, giant band gig. Totally into it. Loved it. Whatever. Yay. Yeah. Oh, God. Lady. You. Anyway. Alright, what am I missing here now that you guys have heard all of my ramblings about my past? Atomic! Hello! This game is called The World Named Fred and it is bizarre. Static? I don't know. <laughs> what? You dingus. And now she says I need to pee and grab my shamaning things. But then I'm all yours. Okay, I've got to go get Ash from Starblocks anyway. I'll meet you on the dock. Oh, sweet. So I have to go get Dumbstick. Yeah, so that's a glimpse into my high school days of uh, being in band and marching band. Alright, she's going that way, so we're good. Let's just run up here. So I have to get him, and I need more coffee. Too much static? I'm not sure what you're hearing, Atomic. I don't think it's it's static. I think it's the air blowing. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm sorry. Is it bothering anyone else, by the way? I need my coffee. Thank you. Alright, I need... Hey! Did... Oh, God damn it. Sorry you can't stay, Atomic. You're hearing static, too? I, that's the game itself. Like, I don't know. I... I'm sorry, guys. That's the game sounds. I can't probably change that. We've got a shaman. Time to go. That? Why did you jump into my face? Hey, get your fucking vampire girlfriend. Let's go. Or not? Why is your girlfriend not coming? Hello? It's because I'm inside. I think it's the air and the water. I swear it's it's coming from the game because it's always been there. I think it's because we're out in the middle of nowhere and we're surrounded by water. It's the wind and the water sounds and they're stupidly high and I can't turn them down. That's, that's the game. My apologies, guys. Wait, am I running too fast? Are you, oh, you're keeping up. Okay. Alright, we need to go oh, there. Die. Wait, you're standing there. Okay. Go down. It's because I'm inside. <laughs> oh, Foxy. Yay. And this is a really long ride on thing. Just creep me out. I don't know why. Ugh. Fucks with my eyeballs. There. Oh. You're literally already there. Arr. Right then. Nice sail. Hey. Got it. Hello. Okay. Oreos. Nice. The unfortunate city of Everglow. Hmm. That sounds wonderful. 
what to do. You want me to keep the spike from turning you two into zombies like the rest of them. I got it. What just happened? Dude, dude, what the fuck was that? What's she doing? What's the spike? It's generic word for kind of crude, self-sustaining, magical effect. You drop it somewhere and it digs into Fred way past the stuff you can see and pulls free energy out of the system. And it uses that energy to do something. This one shuts down people's brains and gives control of their bodies to a collective animal consciousness. Then it reconfigures their metabolism so that they can run off the energy it's pulling from the system. Well, that's my best guess anyway, I didn't write it. <laughs> what? Ah, uh, 90% of them are from out your friends, oh my god. Why the fuck did the sale have the satanic star symbol with a heart? Dude, I don't know. I just, I don't know. It's a ship from hell. She blew love the love the Dude, I used to really like that song. I'll admit it. Yeah, pentagrams aren't satanic unless it's upside down. Okay, that pulsy thing is like weird me out. Okay. It pushes a bowl of bread and uses energy from its sugary insides to turn people into zombies. Oh, and then there isn't any way to poke the hole. There's probably a god out there somewhere with a roll of epic tape in his junk drawer that might work, but there's nothing I can do. That's why we need Meredith. She can protect our minds for a little while. Enough time for us to escape or get eaten anyway. What? What? All the dumb shit that I'm pulling this bitch out. I don't even, like, ah, what is that? Lady, I don't know what's happening, but fuck. Okay, oh. Um. <laughs> and it's upside down. Okay. Matt played that song at the end of the stream. Are you serious? No, it's um, it's upside down with a heart in the middle. Yeah, she blew, man. She blew. All right. Oh, I don't like this. Let me get eaten by a zombie. Are you here, stupid? Yes. Oh, bye guys. Oh man. Ah. What? Whip. It's a pentagram of love. <laughs> Pentagram of Leo. God damn it, you quote thing. I gotta I gotta talk to Puff about that. Every time. <sighs> okay, so um can you, can you open the door? Can I open it? Glow. I'm very sorry, but I do not know you. You know me. I was here once when I was little. <sighs> yes. Easy artifacts. Daughter of Hina. And false artifacts. I sold that name to my brother for a cookie when I was eight. 
Thankfully, he can't spell. So he writes it with Y on the end. I'm capped now. Blame Puff, blame Puff. <laughs> well, Puff gave me, um, he gave me all the script for everything. So the fact that every time a quote's added, it makes it freak out. Yeah. More cannonballs next time to fix it. Oh shit. I will remember. I'll come back to Everglow Cap. Are you sure you want to go inside? It's become a dangerous place. Or is that why you come? Are you here to rescue me? Cannonballs. Works every time. I'm sorry, Everglow. We're just here to do something. Of course. You are aware that I'm full of zombies. We've heard that, yes. Very well. Oh crap, remember we're looking for the public link. I remember it looking sort of like a hole in the ground surrounded by a bunch of glowing blue rings. Yeah, that's my job. Oh god. Oh, I literally have to run around this place and get lost. Don't work everywhere. Sixty percent only. Okay. Why not sixty-nine percent? Yeah, why not? Hey, no, no, no. Oh, they have green blood. It's like bright fluorescent. I don't know why, but it's really cool to me. Damn. Anyway, so, we good. You're not completely useless, I guess. Where do I go? We're spamming. Shh. I've been like wandering around aimlessly looking for a weird thing in the ground. What the fuck is he? Oh, there you are. Oh, what is that noise? There's a mother fucking carousel. And I'm dead. Mother be chess. Mm. Fuck this shit, man. Fuck it all. I just don't even whatever. I'm gone. Look it. And it didn't let me do- ooh, it did let me do the thing. I stunned him. With my square of force. <laughs> There's the gangbang by the Blue Man Group. That is fantastic. I like the way you're thinking.
And these motherfuckers popped up. Racha. Because I was like, is that a carousel? And then they started attacking me. There you are. <laughs> yeah. God damn. Ah. Oh. Swarms of these things are fucking brutal. Where's that growy thing over there? I'm gonna die again. 